in this question there is one time domain signal ft and ft is having the laplace transform equal to fs there is another time domain signal which is yt and yt is equal to summation n equal to 0 to infinity ft minus nt naught and yt is having the laplace transform equal to ys and in this question we are required to calculate ys in terms of fs so let's see how we can calculate ys in terms of fs in the problem signal yt is given it is equal to summation n equal to 0 to infinity f t minus n t naught now looking at the right hand side it is clear that yt is equal to sum of infinite number of terms and to have our solution we will write down three or four initial terms when n is equal to zero we will have our first term and when you put n equal to zero here you will find we are getting ft plus when n is equal to one we will have our second term which is f t minus t naught similarly we have f t minus 2 t naught and so on now we will take the laplace transform we will take the laplace transform laplace transform of yt is equal to ys so we will have ys on the left hand side and on the right hand side we will have fs plus e power minus s t naught multiplied to fs plus e power minus 2s t naught multiplied to fs and so on we are getting fs because we know the laplace transform of ft is equal to fs and we are getting e power minus st naught fs because here we are having the time shifting and using the time shifting property we are having e power minus st naught fs as the laplace transform of ft minus t naught similarly we are getting this result for this time domain signal now you can see one thing fs is common in all the terms so in the next step we will take fs common and we are left with 1 plus e power minus st naught plus e power minus st naught whole square we can write this as e power minus st naught whole square plus the other terms after taking fs common now after this if you focus on the content we are having inside the bracket you will find we are having the sum of infinite terms of geometric progression because 1 e power minus st naught e power minus st naught whole square and so on are the elements of geometric progression because when you calculate the common ratio you will find it is equal to e power minus st naught that is when you divide the second term by first term you will get this and similarly when you divide any next term by the present term you are going to get this result therefore we can say that we are having the sum of infinite terms of gp and we know the sum of infinite gp is equal to a over 1 minus r where a is the first term and you can clearly see that the first term is equal to 1 r is the common ratio we have already calculated it so from here we are getting the sum of infinite gp equal to 1 over 1 minus e power minus st naught so now we have the solution of the content we are having in this bracket so the only thing left is to multiply fs to this to get ys 
So finally, we are getting the Laplace transform Ys equal to Fs divided by 1 minus E power minus S T naught. And this is one standard result. So it is important to remember this result because it can be used directly in some questions. So remember this result. And now we will move on to one example and in this example we will implement this result. You can see in this example signal yt is given, its waveform is like this and if we consider this particular portion of the waveform as signal ft then this portion here will be time shifted version of ft. And the shifting is taking place by 10 units. You can see here we are having t equal to 0 and the same thing is repeated when t is equal to 10. So there is right shifting by 10 units. So we can write this signal here as ft minus 10. Similarly we can write this signal equal to ft minus 20 or we can write ft minus 2 multiplied to 10. Similarly, we can write the following signals. Now it is clear that we can write signal yt equal to sum of the signals we are having. So yt is equal to ft plus ft minus 10 plus ft minus 2 multiplied to 10 and so on. Now compare this with this and you will find t0 is equal to 10. So we are having t0 it is equal to 10 and if you look at this result you will find t0 is required. So we have calculated t0 and now the only thing remaining is fs and to calculate fs we will focus on the time domain signal ft. This means we will focus on this waveform we can easily write down ft in terms of step signals if you look at the waveform of signal ft you will find it is equal to zero initially so ft is equal to zero initially then you can see there is upward level switching and upward level switching is taking place when t is equal to zero and the amount of discontinuity is equal to a naught and as there is upward level switching we will have plus sign the amount of discontinuity multiplied to ut minus 0 we are writing ut minus 0 because the switching is taking place when t is equal to 0 this is nothing new we have done this many times before after this signal flow is like this and when t is equal to 2 there is downward level switching so we have negative sign and the discontinuity is equal to a naught so we have a naught multiplied to ut minus 2 now simplifying this we are getting ft equal to a naught inside the bracket ut minus ut minus 2 now we can simply obtain the Laplace transform and have fs. On the right hand side we will have a0 inside the bracket 1 over s minus e power minus 2s 1 over s. 1 over s we can take common so we will have a0 over s inside the bracket 1 minus e power minus 2s. So this is our Laplace transform fs. So we have fs, we have t0, we can calculate ys which is the Laplace transform of signal yt and this was our task. So finally we are getting the Laplace transform ys equal to a0 over s multiplied to 1 minus e power minus 2s which is the value of fs divided by 1 minus e power 
minus s t naught t naught is equal to 10 so we have minus 10 s so this is our answer and I hope you now have clear understanding of this process and now I will end this lecture here if you have any doubt you may ask in the comment section but don't forget this result because we can use it to solve the questions like this